Hey folks, uh, as I began praying this prayer titled Election and really let the words sink in, I was honestly moved to tears because I was so overwhelmed by the thought that the same God who created me, who knows that I am so fickle uh, and so weak of faith, still chooses me every single day. And he doesn't regret it. He just loves me as he always has. Uh, so just join me, please take a moment out of your day and let's pray together. Holy Trinity, all praise to you for electing me to salvation. By the foreknowledge of God the Father, through the sanctification of the Spirit, unto obedience and sprinkling of the blood of Jesus. I adore the wonders of your condescending love, marvel at the true believer's high privilege, within whom all heaven comes to dwell, abiding in God and God in him. I believe it, help me experience it to the full. Continue to teach me that Christ's righteousness satisfies justice and proves our love. Help me to make use of it by faith as the ground of my peace and of your favor and acceptance so that I may live always near the cross. It is not feeling the spirit that proves my saved state, but the truth of what Christ did perfectly for me. All holiness in him is by faith made mine as if I had done it. Therefore, I see the use of his righteousness for satisfaction to divine justice and making me righteous. It is not inner sensation that makes Christ's death mine, for that may be delusion, being without the word, but his death appropriated by my faith and so testified by word and spirit. I bless you for these lively exercises of faith, for the righteousness that is mine in Jesus, for grace to surrender my will to you. I rejoice to think that all things are at your disposal and I love to leave them there. Then prayer turns wholly into praise and all I can do is to adore and love you. I don't want the favor of man to lean upon, for I know that your electing grace is infinitely better. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. I believe it. Help me experience it to the full. Now that line really cuts deep because that's exactly who I am. I know it, I believe it, perhaps, but somehow so very often, it's just not the reality that I live out of. My belief so often fades and my faith so often fails. I turn so easily away from God, my Father, towards things that can never satiate my soul. You know, we're all driven by emotions, but as this prayer reminds me, it's not about what I feel. It's not about that inner sensation, because that's so easily deceived, I'm so easily manipulated. But God's truth and God's election of me rests solely on Him and His doing. You know, the God who cannot even be contained in the heavens chose to save me. The Holy Trinity that has always existed chose to know my name and chose to bless me with a higher purpose and a higher privilege before the very foundations of this universe were laid. And to think that His holiness you know, this unattainable holiness only through faith because of the price that Jesus lovingly paid for me can be mine. And that just makes me love him so much more and to adore him as well. So I just hope that this prayer has helped you just as much as it has helped me to believe and to experience his grace, which really is infinitely better than anything else. Thank you.